Okay, let's play Atari games with deep reinforcement learning. We're going to use Atari. I will go ahead and run this. I need to first run this in Colab, actually. We're going to run this first part here that will detect that we're in Colab, and it also installs a variety of packages that we need to make use of. This allows us to render the video for these games right into Colab. All right, that's all installed. We're going to make use of Virtual Atari. This is, this is very much built into the packages that we're using. In Virtual Atari, it has, they, keep, they keep all of these cartridges that are, I don't know that they're actually in the public domain, but they are available for us to train the video games on. We're using the Stella Atari Simulator. This really does work best in any environment that's not Windows. But there are ways that you can make Windows do this. The installation procedure is here. We're going to look at a couple of different games. We're going to use Atari Breakout, and we're going to also look at... Well, I'll give you the instructions anyway for how to play Atlantis again. We're going to run this code here that sets up the model. So we're using a PPO like before. And you can change it to Breakout or to Atlantis and rerun it if you want to see it play Atlantis. It sets a certain number of time steps that it's going to use. So it's going to run nearly 100,000 and it will learn. And then we save the model once we're completed and it prints out the mean reward at the end. So we're going to let this run through and train. This does take a moment. Actually, it can take, uh, I think, up to 10 minutes. GPU definitely helps. You can see it continuing here. It's at 73,000. It will get up to 100 and then stop. All right, we're complete. Let's get this code running here that will generate a video for it. It is simply going to run run it through, play the game. It's going to use the, the loop that that we have here. It loops it through and renders the video. Once this is finished, we can observe the video here and watch it play Breakout. You can see it becomes pretty effective at batting it back up there. All right, thank you for watching the video, and if this was useful, please give me a like and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss anything in the future.